Hey, what's up everyone? Danny and Alex. In this tutorial, I want to show some basic moves you can do from back control. So check it out. All right, so the back control position sometimes is going to be held with the seat belt control on either side or sometimes with double unders like this and holding the lapel. All right. Now, of course, you're going to have two hooks here, but just for demonstration, I'm going to keep my feet on the outside because I like to show what I'm doing here. Okay. So look, what we're going to do is we're going to start here in the double unders right now. We're going to be in this direction. The first attack is the collar choke. Just like you do the collar choke from the close guard position or the mount, we can also perform from the back control position as well. So what I'm going to do is remove one of my hooks and pass it over the shoulder. Now, once I'm here, look, I use this free hand to tug onto his lapel so I have it nice and tight. Once I have this grip, I can let go and the other grip is going to reach for the far side. So I'm going to go to this side of his jacket nice and tight and watch. Every time you choke now, you're going to bring this elbow almost hidden behind the shoulder while you bring this grip down towards his belt line. Okay, so it looks like this from here into your choke. All right, so let's take a look one more time. So if I had the hooks, this would be my position where I start from here. Now I'm pinching my knees tight against his waistline. Remove one, tug, remove the slack. Now I go for this far side lapel. Now once I have this, I bring this arm, my right elbow behind the shoulder and I turn into the choke. Now the second one, we're going to go over the shoulder once again, tug down to remove the slack and we have the lapel. Now this time his elbow is tight so I can't reach, okay, that's one option. The other option could be that he's removing this from my reach, alright, so now I can't grip so he knows what's up. So we're going to use this arm and bring it behind his head instead. So you bring your grip behind the neck and now you use the same thing as you turn for the single wing choke, alright. Let's take a look one more time, this time with the hooks. So now you would have this starting position, pinching with the knees. Now from here, look, you go over, remove the slack, grip, bring the arm behind the neck, and now lean into him to create the single wing choke. All right, for the last technique, I'm going to look at an arm bar. So I'm going to remove this grip and reach over behind his neck and grab my own jacket right here. So that makes a nice grip onto his shoulder. Now, once I have this grip, look, I'll let go of this one as well. I start to lean onto the arm, lean onto my left side as I frame his face. Now, as I fell here, look, this leg will pass in front of his face to make him fall right into the arm bar attack. So one more time, grab your own lapel right here. Once you have this, as you lean to this direction, start to frame him. You fall, but he can't follow, and then he'll land right into the arm bar position. All right, guys, so there you have it. Three basic submission techniques from the back control. Hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Leave us a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe. We'll see you in the next video. Take care.